Mom's having an emotional piano moment here. Music has brought a different feeling to our home than ever before. It's a pretty cool moment. I'm just so excited. Hello and good morning everyone. How is everybody doing today? It is Wednesday. It is that middle of the week when you're like, I've made it this far. I can get through the rest of the week. Kind of how we're feeling today. Although Wednesdays are good days because I get to sleep in a little bit longer, get a little bit of rest. It's always a good day. The kids are looking forward to tomorrow and we actually have really, really fun plans on Friday that I cannot wait for. Something we had to book way far in advance. Hit the like button if you guys want to know what that is. I might tell you tomorrow. I just might. All good things going down today. Brandon's at the gym right now. Sometimes we need to get away from life and escape, whether that be the gym, go on a walk, just have a little bit of you time. Brandon is there. Kids are home from school doing their homework. Daisy has been working on these alphabet books. She really loves them. He's having fun. He a dry erase and you need like a little paper towel and it yeah. kind of helps you learn about the ABC. So this one, which letters are A in that group? Can you tell me? This one. Which other one? Um, this one. Good job. Okay, you got it, girl. Over here, we have these hands some boys. Crew is working on some homework. Braxton is doing a little bit of reading. Kids are being productive, getting stuff done. I can hear Ryler upstairs emptying trashes. I'm so grateful for his help and doing his chores without even being asked. Hint, hint. Kids are actually done pretty great at doing their chores. Working on the normal grind. Did go out today. Try and find a rug, some great pillows for the piano room. I love that we can call it a piano room. I'll tell you, I had zero success because I was messaging with Lauren, the girl that has helped us with all of our house. Basically, everything I'm looking at is a little bit off. She just has really great style and she just puts things together really well. So I'm trying to work with her. I did want to get some new pillows for this room, liven it up a little bit. Working on it, work in progress for sure, but I did get word from the piano guy that they are coming today. You're very excited for that. Santa! I know him! Gotta go down the chimneys, guys. All right, guys, that's a lot of trash from upstairs. Sure is. Thank you for emptying the trashes. You're a rock star. Did you put your laundry away? I actually did. Oh, freaking high five, bud. I and ended I also, up holding the laundry for Rye Guy and he put it away. It was a win-win because I got to watch my show while I folded laundry. Hey, I, mean, I put laundry away. I appreciate everything you're doing. Yeah. Like an angel right now. See you later. Bye. Oh my gosh. Is that the silverback? Is that the silverback? Is that the silverback? I got a piano in the back. You want it? You wish you did. That looks really cool in your truck. Oh, thank you. But you don't look cool. Just the truck. Does it add to my coolness at all? No, nope, no, 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 no. Should I roll the window back up? Yeah. All right, see Let's you not let anyone know who's inside. I finished the book. What book is this? Batman, Grind, and Punishment. This one you got for Christmas? Mm -hmm. Brex, that's way awesome. I know you just started reading it like two days ago, so that's really awesome. Mm -hmm. Have you read the entire Dogman series? No, we don't have every book. Oh. Well, we better fix that. B, I got you a little treat while I was at the store. Oh my gosh, that is my favorite post-workout. Cotton candy birthday oh. flavor. <laughs> Home Goods has a great selection. Oh my gosh. This is an amazing stash. This one says birthday cake. Is that the flavor? Yeah, I think so. Holy cow, I'm trying this Anyways, right I know you like cotton candy. Found them at the store. Thank you. I'll Still of a deal. Still of a deal. This is a great post-workout. They say to have cotton candy within 30 minutes of your workout so they can get straight to your muscles. <laughs> Tip for the day. All right, guys, I'm Silverback from the gym, and we are at the house now. <laughs> Silverback. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys remember and you recall, we talk about this all the time, but Wednesday is our crazy chaotic day. We got a few moving pieces today. As usual, we have Hazy's music, Hazy's dance, we have Rye Guy basketball practice. Rye Guy has an activity tonight with the youth in the neighborhood that I'm in charge of. And to add on top of that, we have the delivery of the piano going down between two and four today. So thankfully, called in a lifeline. We got Aunt Lindsay coming to the rescue. She is gonna be taking Hazy to both music and dance. She offered to have Hazy over to play and just offered to take her to both of those and bring her home. That is a huge help. It's a massive help, you guys. And mom has been very fortunate. Sometimes Stephanie will step up and do that. Lindsay today doing that. And it really helps on a day like today where we need to camp out and wait for this piano to be delivered because obviously that's not the kind of thing they can leave on the doorstep. We are on standby holding pattern waiting for that piano to be delivered while we continue to knock out all the things that have to be done today, you guys. But I gotta say, because I was kind of in a downer day yesterday. I don't know if you could tell. If you all go back and watch the video, maybe you can see. Could you sense the mood was a little low? However, mom saved my bacon, my day, my butt. Mom <laughs> saved the day by offering me unlimited free hugs until midnight. So I had what, like seven, eight hugs yesterday? Yeah, I think and that, how many do you normally get? I would say I've had seven or eight in our marriage. So <laughs> seven or eight hugs yesterday to pick me up and pull me through the day. But what I neglected to recognize the outpouring of likes on yesterday's video, you guys, because I jokingly said at this 
video gets to 50,000 likes, I would take piano lessons. Are you almost there? No. But in a huge effort from you guys, it passed like 10,000 likes on the first day. I don't think that's ever happened. Almost tempted as a reward for that support to try my hand at a little bit of piano, something. Maybe just hang out with mom while she learns, try and pick up a few things because I was so surprised by the number of people who did hit that like button in an effort to get it to 50,000. Now I knew 50,000 was out there. I don't know if we have any videos with 50,000 likes. To see 10,000 likes within the first 24 hours on a video tells me that you guys may want to see that. So with the piano coming today, there's some excitement, some buzz around that. And who knows? Maybe I'll sit down, play a little something. Tickle the ivories. Tickle the ivories, ivories as I like to say. Isn't that what they call it? That's the thing, isn't it? Yeah, but you say it all the time. You I, say, every time we talk about a piano, you're like, ooh, are we going to tickle the ivories? I just like to tickle. It's weird. Kids are doing their homework chores. All that stuff's going underway. I think that they're almost like wrapping that up, actually. And so the piano should be here like in the next hour or so. Stand by, everybody. Claire and crew have been really baking up a storm here on the Easy Bake Oven over the last few days. They got through all of like the Easy Bake packets that come with the oven that crew got for Christmas. So now they're going like full blown homemade. Claire looked up a recipe online for chocolate chip cookies that can be made in an Easy Bake Oven and they're going through and finding like ingredients around the house, like actual flour, sugar. Actually pretty amazing how well you guys know your way around the kitchen to be honest. <laughs> they're getting out all the ingredients, putting together the mixture, they're making the dough right here and then they're going to make a batch of chocolate chip cookies homemade in the Easy Bake Oven. We lost crew's tray so we had to get him a new one. This one is brand new. First thing we're gonna click it's on. It's bigger. It. It's wider. Is that one bigger? Yes, it is. But it'll fit, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. I already checked. Can't think of a better way to pass the time and wait for that piano to arrive than to bake some fresh chocolate chip cookies. They are now in the Easy Bake Oven. It's about 12, 15 minutes until they are completely done. We're gonna check on them here in just a little bit. Already smells like fresh baked cookies here in the house. All done in the Easy Bake Oven. And what's funny is mom actually wanted to make cookies today because she just wanted like a little bit of cookies, but she was afraid if she made the entire batch, we'd probably just devour them. Well, now we can tell these little cookie morsels courtesy of Crew and Claire. 11 minutes later. Okay, the smell of fresh baked cookies has brought the entire neighborhood over. Oh my gosh, they actually look very good. What do you think, like a little bit longer? They're kind of doughy, no, they might dry good. out. That's very hot though, very hot to the touch. Coming out pretty nice right now. I think, look at this, this is like a literal perfect mini cookie right there. Texture, thickness, doneness, everything. That is a delicious little morsel of chocolate chip cookies. He's Holy cow. definitely making another batch. I think it's time for batch number two. That one turned out, oh wait, you still have some dough left over from the first batch. Yeah. You guys wanna turn these into some cookies? Yeah. And then while this one cooks, you could make another yeah. round of dough if you wanted. And then we can just eat that. First taste test, we're gonna see how they actually taste because they look good, they smell good, they seem like cookies, walks like a duck, quacks like a duck, but is it a duck? What do you think? Three, two, one. Taste test going down. Easy Big Oven cookies from scratch. What do you They're think? They're real chocolate chip cookies. That's a straight up chocolate chip cookie, right? You guys just home baked chocolate chip cookies in an easy bake oven using ingredients found around the house. That's some next level stuff right there. And I gotta give mad props to Claire because she's kind of like the baking professional. Now, Crew's picking up some great skills here. Claire, quite the baker, knows her way around this kitchen. But I don't wanna jinx it, but they've actually also been able to do this without making a gigantic mess that's pretty well contained so far, but they are about to do a lot of flour in here, so let's see how that goes. If you didn't know, Claire's family has their own YouTube channel oh, called yeah. The McNeil Fam. I'll link it for you guys. You can watch Claire bake all day. Plus, they do a lot of fun challenges, things like that. You guys should check it out. It. What have you been doing if you haven't subscribed? What have you been doing? <laughs> what have you been doing with your life? You've been missing out on all this Claireness? Double the recipe this time, you guys. We're gonna have double the cookies coming out of here. I'm hoping that by the time these cookies come out, the piano should be here because these take about 12, 15 minutes. The piano's supposed to arrive in 15 minutes. I think we may be able to time that perfectly. We give the piano guys, piano movers, some cookies for their efforts. Yeah. This is a false alarm right now. Everyone just came Hi. running to the door and it's just a cute kid dropping something off from Mindy. Not really. It is not the piano. Panic for nothing. Well, don't worry guys, we have butter. Why don't you put that, are we missing butter? There you go, there's some butter. <laughs> I'm gonna play that butter like Beethoven's fifth. Just then. Yes, that'd be great. Go to show me where you're This is the moment that just arrived. The just door the just rang. No false alarms, no more butter, no more t-shirts. This is an actual Seriously. piano coming in the house right now for the very first time in our lives. A piano entering our home, transforming this into the piano room. Piano room. We will now officially be like, oh, in the piano room. It's like, which one's the front room? Which one's the living room? The piano, piano room. room. TV room, piano room. Done. Done. Ooh. 
It has been delivered. It is official. This is now the piano room. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the piano room. We don't have to play anything on it. We gotta play something. Who wants to play something? Anybody wanna play a song? Mary had a little laugh. I, I, I know. I'm just gonna push the first key. Can I do it? Are you ready? Oh! <gasps> Hold on, you lift this up. Do the little thing. That's gonna just, the sound is just gonna just billow through oh, the house already. Oh, yeah. Oh! <laughs> That's all we know. Kirby, dude, step it up, bro. First one, pull out that bench. This is gonna be our new place where you practice piano. I mean, dude, we're gonna get some seriously good use out of this one. Better. Doesn't it feel like a more like legit setup? Show us what you got. Here we go. Okay, first song. Da 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 da. It sounds fantastic, though. <laughs> it sounds so good. Mom's having an emotional piano moment here, and I think it's just the music has brought a different feeling to our home than ever before. And to hear this, and to see your own children play it, and to know you're gonna be learning it too, it's a pretty cool moment. I'm just so excited. Yeah, Carmen! <laughs> Fantastic, wow. Hey, Carmen, by the way, second person to play on this piano. That's a pretty big honor there, Carmen. <laughs> I wasn't videoing. Should I do it now for yeah, the just camera try it now, for now that I know that yeah. I can? Here goes nothing. Literally. First song ever played. That's incredible, that Mindy. The adult. Hey, theater, that's like... even the adult one. I thought hey, that was I the four-year-old. I haven't even had my first lesson yet. That's I just pretty taught incredible. myself. That's incredible. <laughs> energy around learning and playing piano right now is actually like electric. Kids want to jump in, they want to learn some songs, they want to teach each other, so Brexton teaching Carmen, Crew and Claire are going to do some lessons. I don't know how really to even explain that feeling. As soon as the kids played on the piano, immediately their friends were like, I want to learn that, can you teach me how to play that song? And so now they're just in there playing on the piano. Anybody who has kids taking piano, you know that it can be a struggle, like, hey, do your practice, do your practice, I don't want to practice, I want to quit piano, I'm tired of piano. But the minute this came in the house, like that energy, that passion, just electric, it's in the air, they can't get enough of it. The first thing they did when it came in, they all were doing different things, playing on computers, so baking cookies. They immediately washed their hands, ran in and said, I want to play on the piano. I know. love that the kids are excited about it. It's not like, oh, Nate, you got a piano. And then they go about their business. They can't wait to be in that room. They can't it's wait to be playing. so pretty. They're and not we, teaching their friends. We want to finish up a couple of things in that room. A really pretty piece of art we want to purchase to put above it. Something we've been eyeing for a little while. She so. reframed a couple things that we're going to hang up that kind of matches all like that gold, gold accents. It's going to be really great. We'll put that all together, show you guys what it looks like. But for now, that is the piano room. It's official. It's so amazing. It's perfect. All the excitement and hubbub of the piano being delivered. Rye Guys practice has snuck and crept up on us. It is five minutes before practice. Thankfully, practice is three minutes away, so we're loading them in the car. Let's get off to practice, bro, and get you shooting some hoops. You know if you've seen from Instagram, Stephanie went and helped me look for a piano. Now, the pro herself is here, and she yeah. learned this really, really hard song, and she's gonna play it for Brex. She already played it for me, but now okay, she's gonna play it for Brexy. Okay, Brex is ready.
wow, this is different. I'm all dressed up. Mom's full PJs. And are you ready for your piano concert? Nor That's what I'm getting ready for. Normally, I'm full PJs and you look quite nice. So this is a little I know. Here. Well, you know. It is bedtime. All I could do to stay in real clothes. The piano is now in the house. It has found a home in our home, bringing music and magic to the Bingham household. To my heart. We are so stoked to have that bring, the feeling that it brings. And as Very kids special. learn, mom learns. As we have people come over and play, it's just been beautiful filling the home with music today. And kids and are you know, excited. This will be in our home for the rest of our lives. I don't know people that just get rid of a piano because they're tired of it. I feel like, yeah, I feel like it's once like you have a, a piano, a piece of you've got a piano. Too, so. It's like a silverback truck. Once you get it, oh my gosh. you're just never going to get rid of it. But then also, you guys, very cool for Claire and crew to bake in the kitchen today. Ever yeah. since crew got his easy bake oven, that was one thing that he wanted to do is have some bake do. sessions with Claire and so I'm glad they got And I love that, that they used real food yes. instead of the easy bake food. Turned out fantastic too. So proud of them. That was so cool. I know, that was so cool. major weekend plans coming up. Remember, hit the like button if you want to know what we're doing. It's yes. going to be so much fun. You guys are coming along with us regardless. So we cannot wait to do that. We love you guys. Thanks for being a part of our day. We'll every day. Good night. Bye. You sit on me. Like <laughs> I just don't like to tickle. It's weird. <laughs> weird. weird. I'm more like to be tickled, I guess. Uh, okay, we're getting weird with the tickle thing. So where do we go from here? And <laughs> tickle stuff got weird.